this lost city is a type of movie that we've all been missing for a while, especially because of the pandemic. And uh, it's fun, it's big, and it's packed with adventure. So a lot of people seem to be welcoming this movie with excitement, including myself. So how do you guys feel right now uh, as we're getting closer to the release date? Sandra, you go first. I keep blocking out that the release date is coming <laughs> so fast. You know, it's like there's nothing else we can do. I know we all worked crazy hard, but we also had such a good time with the people of the Dominican Republic. We got we got we had a once in a lifetime opportunity and I think we all we all worked hard, but we also knew how lucky we were to be in a pandemic and to be able to make a story like this that could maybe bring some joy and some some adventure. You never quite know how it's going to work out, but once we saw the final product and we were done editing, we sat back and we were like, I cannot believe we managed to pull this off in a time when, you know, leaving your house was was just a task. I'm just I'm just really proud. I'm really proud of what everyone did to work together to bring it to the screens. Actually, people are dying to see the dynamic between you two because Daniel, you not only starred alongside the effervescent Sandra Bullock, but you decided to just kidnap her. Well, exactly. So, well, what would you do? Um, if you wanted, if she had knew where the treasure was, it's the only rational thing a person can do is to kidnap somebody and make them uh, everything. Keep her by your side forever. Well, what exactly. was it like working with her for the first time? And how was she like as your co-star and as your hostage? Um, she was a wonderful <laughs> hostage. Um, she was very accommodating. Um, she, uh, I mean, it was not surprising in any way to learn that Sandra is fantastic to work with and you know incredibly generous and playful in scenes um the thing that like amazed me was on this job specifically is how much of a producer she was like she really produced this movie along with liza from the ground up um and that's very impressive a lot of actors sort of saying they're a producer they don't really do anything so uh that was very very cool to watch um but yeah i i definitely had a few moments of being on set and you know the 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 13-year-old boy inside me that's watching Speed has to pinch himself being like, this is crazy that I'm working with this person. I want to ask you the same question to Sandra as well. What was it oh. like working with uh, then when Harry Potter and now the billionaire? And you go, yes, I understand that based on his career, he has he's already had to carry a very heavy load in terms of expectation because he carried an entire franchise since he was tiny. So you could often meet a person who was an absolute disaster by that time, entitled, unkind, you know, just, and then in walks this person who's so open and accommodating and a team player and happy to be there, just genuinely filled with gratitude. I, that's what I was uh, unexpected for me. I thought we were gonna get maybe a little bit of a diva and we didn't. We got this extraordinary human being who just, brought to life a character that's really hard to make grounded. What he did with Fairfax is is really hard to do. Really hard to do. Clip it, put it on my IMDb page, that's my new reel. Oh. <laughs> she has the key to the lost city. Pick it and fling it! You pick it and fling it! Uh, Don't make it sound. <laughs> Sandra Bullock, Channing Tatum, Shin Sun-do, 100% movie! Oh yeah! That man was already unconscious. Lost City, 4월 21일 대개